Greetings and salutations, guys and gals. Give me just a minute here. I'm going to set up the live stream on my end, and I'll be right with you. Probably be about a minute or two. Hang tight. few more moments all right almost there guys let me pop this chat out and see what we're dealing with who we're dealing with who do we got here in just a minute we got Electro. What's up, Electro? How you doing, brother? Michael, have been a long time, man. How are you doing as well? Vaping, uh, been vaping, man. Good suggestion there. Chucky Lot, what is up? Electro again. J Doe, what's up, Jake? Long time. Saw your video that you're going to retire soon. No! <laughs> J Doe, not retiring. Just uh, retiring from video gaming for the most part, but maybe, uh, maybe picking up some real fishing and some other stuff in the future. Dean, thanks, man. Do appreciate it. All right, guys. Welcome to the stream. We are in the Czech Republic, and uh, we're going to go ahead and get fishing. Here, I got Ash with me, member of Team JVD. How you doing, Ash? All right. Good to hear. <laughs> All right, guys. Let's go ahead and spawn in here. Um, spawned in at the other side. And we're going to go ahead and uh, cast out here. Let me get these casted out and I'll get to the chat. Sometimes it takes a while for these fish to bite uh, when you're bottom fishing for them. So I'm just going to go ahead and cast out there and then I'll get to the chat. Got uh, got something to mention that I want to mention here today to you all. Um, it was suggested to me by a couple of uh, subscribers. So I'll get into that in a little bit. Let me go ahead and cast this out there as well. We'll see if we can't catch a few silver bream, maybe some roach, possibly some carp. Oh, that didn't work out too well. Let's try again. But how you guys doing out there in YouTube land? Let me know how the quality of the stream is, if it's laggy. I have been experiencing issues with lag for some reason recently. I have no idea why. And uh, we'll go ahead. Sorry, reading the chat. Hold on a minute. Looks like it's laggy on my end, if it's laggy in your guys' end. All right, let me get to the chat uh, real quick. Michael says, hell yeah, bud, stay off them smokes. Right on. Yeah, I, I do still smoke occasionally, like when I go to the bars and stuff like that. But uh, for the most part, when I'm at home, I am vaping. And I felt a big difference, dude. Big difference with vaping. Oh, there we go. We got a hit. Let's go ahead and see what we got on here. Big difference with vaping than uh, compared to smoking. Joseph, I uh, do not believe that the new lakes are available on PS4 yet. They should be coming out. I believe the uh, rumor has it that the lakes will be released to PS4. Look at that. Trophy Prussian Carp, not bad. Will be released to PS4 as soon as I get all the bugs ironed out on PC. As far as I know, let's go ahead and cast back out there. So when that will be exactly, I have no idea. I see you, Ash. I see you. I'll go ahead and disconnect the Discord here in a moment. Guys, give me a second. going to disconnect the old Discord here. Sometimes that uh, 
fixes the problem. Quit Discord. Maybe that'll work. All right. If it's too unbearable out there for you guys, if it's still lagging and everything like that, not fixing it, let me know. Um, unfortunately, not much I can do about that, but uh, if it gets too unbearable, let me know and I'll quit the stream. Looks like we got something else biting out here. Not quite sure what it is yet. J Doe says, okay, cool. Electro says, laser. Yep, he's got it. He's got it. Electro's got it under control there. Gamer Kevin PS4, how have you been, brother? Long time no see. Good to see you in the Discord, man. Joker says, any idea if the European links? No. Uh, like, like was previously mentioned, uh, they will be available. I'm pretty, pretty certain of that. Exactly when they'll be available, I do not know. Joseph says, thanks. Your videos have helped me out a lot. Appreciate it. No problem, man. No problem. Glad to do them. Do enjoy the game. Do enjoy fishing. Do we got a fish on here? We got a fish on. We, we got to wait till it starts buzzing. There we go. Let's reel this in and see what we got on the line. Fishing with sweet peas right now. Generally, they... Uh, whoop, whoop, whoop. Let's put that... There we go. Right about there. Had to adjust the drag a bit there. Fishing with sweet peas are our mirror carp and young common carp in here, and they tend to hit the young, or the young, the uh, sweet peas. Oh, looks like we got a mirror carp on the line. It's a nice fish for this uh, low level lake. Here we go. Boom, boss. Look at that young mirror carp. That looks like a big one for, uh, for this lake. $64, 1.460 pounds. We'll keep her, put her in the keep net. I'm going to go ahead and cast back out there. Where were we at? Let's go to our map. Real quick, and we will uh, mark that buoy. Set a mark for the last fish. Yes, and there we go. Help me out here, remembering where these fish are. Cast right back out in that general area. So, uh, some of you guys may have noticed that I have big announcement in the title of the video here, or special announcement, or something of that nature. I can't remember. But uh, let me explain to you what's going on here. Um, recently, some of you guys may have seen the video that I did regarding, uh, regarding changes coming to the channel in the future. One of the things that has been recommended to me, or requested I should say, from a lot of you guys has been to go out and do some real fishing, which I would love to do. <laughs> Unfortunately, um, I am in financial hi hiatus at the moment and cannot afford to do that. So some people have, uh, some of the subscribers saw that video and requested that I start a GoFundMe page to get the fishing equipment needed to, to go out there and film some uh, real fishing. Uh, reading this, yep. Yeah. There we go. So there's, uh, Tommy's kind of, or Tommy is, is Ash in game. He's kind of explaining it to you guys. A couple people said, go start a GoFundMe. I said, ah, you know, I don't want to do that. I feel like I'm kind of you know begging for money and that's not a good idea but more than just one or two people uh, said I should probably do it and so I figured what the heck I'm gonna put it out there there is a GoFundMe page that I have if you guys would like no pressure of course but if you guys would like to uh, see real fishing videos in the future if I don't find a uh, find a good job <laughs> Anytime soon, I won't be able to afford to get the equipment, and if you would like to help out, there is a GoFundMe link. It is below in the description below. No pressure to do so. If you guys want to read it, check it out, see why I need the GoFundMe link, all that kind of stuff, feel free to do so. Um, but like I said, definitely no pressure to anybody. It's just a thought, just an idea uh, to get some stuff so I can get out there and get some real fishing videos out there for you guys. Um, would be a help. With that said... With that said, I, uh, I'm going to go ahead and, and not talk about it. Unless you guys have any questions about it, let me know. But for the most part, we're just going to do some fishing here on the Lesnay Villa Fishery. Um, Tommy Tommy was pushing me pretty pretty hard, too. Uh, he actually wanted to start the GoFundMe page. Told me about it. And then uh, he had some issues being from another country. He's from Belgium. I'm from America. And uh, I guess there was some monetary issues with the difference in currencies and whatnot. So... 
Uh, he told me about how he wanted to start it up. I decided to do it. We got a fish on. I decided to go ahead and start it up. So uh, it's currently under my name. But the full reason why I started it is listed there. If you guys want to check it out, feel free to. Much appreciated. Anybody who supports, that would be awesome. So out here, I'm fishing with two things. I got the bread with honey, which seems to be uh, working pretty good for the smaller fish, like the bream and uh, apparently young common carp as well. <laughs> First one I've caught off of this bread with honey out here. But that's not a bad-sized fish for this lake. Not bad for bread with honey either. 69 bucks. We're going to go ahead and keep it. I'm going to go ahead and cast back out there. All right, let me get to the uh, let me get to the chat real quick. Joker says, "Awesome, can't wait to post some videos of the some real fishing, brother." But I have enjoyed your gaming videos. Thank you, Joker. I'm looking forward to uh, getting started on that sometime, hopefully around summertime. Cove, what is up, man? How are you doing? Welcome to the stream, dude. Good to have you in here. See you comment on a few of the recent videos, and good to see that, man. Thanks a lot. <coughs> Gamer Kevin says he's down to help Tommy. Man, that would be a that would be a big help. I remember you also mentioning before that you wanted to donate, Gamer Kevin, and uh, I, if I remember cor correctly, we couldn't quite figure out how to get that set up. But uh, the GoFundMe page, I think, is pretty automatic, and uh, yeah, that would be awesome if you did that, man. Would be real cool. And uh, Tommy, Tommy, <laughs> Tommy's pedaling for it. Yeah, right. Yeah, I gotta, I gotta be honest. I've met, honestly, guys, I've met some, uh, met some awesome people due to the channel. As a matter of fact, um, I met some of the coolest people, some of my best friends I've honestly met through this channel. Individuals who, uh, individuals who I talk to on a regular basis. Have been uh, have been subscribers of the channel that I've actually befriended, talked to in Discord. Ash, Tommy is one of uh, I consider him one of my best friends right now. Stitch as well. Uh, a couple other individuals, Skill, and yeah, I mean, and everybody in the chat too. All you guys, Gamer Kevin, Cove, um, a whole bunch of people that I, I can't think of everybody offhand, but man, there's so many people that have been really supportive, really. Hopping into the streams all the time. It's really cool to see that. And uh, I thank you guys for that and the, and the support for that. Let's get back to the chat. Hello, Luke. How are you doing today? J Doe's taking off. He's got to do some gaming. No problem. Luke says, biggest catfish. What is the biggest catfish I've caught in game or in reality? And Joker says, what is your favorite kind of fish to fish for when you fish for real? Myself, I like to fish for bass. Catfish there in Missouri. All right, let me answer one at a time. Luke, biggest catfish in reality would be a uh, about a 10-pound flathead catfish that I caught off of a black artificial night crawler. Joker, I'd have to go with bass, man. Definitely would have to say that bass is my favorite go-to fish. Love the fight. Largemouth bass. Haven't really we got a fish on here. Haven't really fished for uh, smallmouths yet. Although I knew, know there is a river in my area where you can uh, get a lot of small mouse out of. I'm going to try to do that uh, in the future when I can get out there. I hear small mouse put up a very good aggressive fight in reality. And I want to give them a shot as well. But definitely bass. And uh, next to that would probably be catfish. They put up a good fight too. Different type of fight than bass. But we got a young mirror carp here. Look at that guy. 1.139 pounds 50 bucks we'll keep them put them in the keep nut and then I also mainly fish for bluegill and crappie and various other pan fish like perch occasionally as well have been out steelhead fishing a few times and I've caught a couple of those guys and they were pretty cool as well all right got that rod back out there just a second here guys Cove says, fast to pick the rods with the hockeys. Yeah, I know. I'm just, I'm in my habits of, of uh, putting my, putting, putting, putting my hand icon over the rods right now. If I remember to do the hockeys, I probably will. I'll probably get screwed up and pick up the wrong rod if I do that. But, <laughs> yeah, I'll definitely keep that in mind, Cove. 
Tommy says, thank you, Gamer Kevin. This guy has <laughs> never supported anyone like this. If he was a DJ, we we'll be... <laughs> There we go. Yeah. Thank you, Tommy. Thank you, Tommy. Do appreciate that, man. Yeah, like I said, Tommy's a great guy, man. Uh, known as Ash in game. Met him through the channel. Didn't know him a day before. A day before uh, I started the channel, he was a subscriber. Started leaving comments. We started communicating. Became a member of Discord. We started talking quite frequently. And now, uh, even though I never met the guy in person, I'd say he's probably one of my best friends. Uh, probably knows more about me than anybody else, to be honest with you. But uh, Luke says that is right. All right. Yeah. Nissan says they added Europe now. Yes, they have added Europe to PC. Uh, if you're a P PS4 gamer, unfortunately, it has not been released yet. But it should be coming to you guys sometime in the near future. Unfortunately, I don't know when. But if I get word of it being released, I will definitely let you guys know. As I was just saying, it's Max 79. I am not aware of when the update will be coming to console. Not yet. But when I do know, I'll be sure to post it for you guys so you guys can uh, find that out. Nissan says he might have to play this again. Yeah, it's a good game, dude. It's a good game. Relaxing game, enjoyable game. Still enjoy it. I've been playing this game for close to two years now, and I still enjoy it. Cove says Jan 20th of January. That would be cool. 20th of January would be really good for you guys because uh, it's pretty close. <laughs> pretty close. Guys, uh, I wish they would correlate the updates together with console and uh, PS4, but they don't. I don't know why. I guess they tried to use PC as a guinea pig to see if it works and then go from there. Nolan's Fishing, what is up? Welcome to the stream, man. How you doing? Alright, not getting any hits right now. Might have to pick these rods up and cast back out there. Ah, the Pike Tour is going on. Did not know that. Or actually, I see those pop-ups. I usually automatically close out of them when I see them in Fishing Planet, but that's cool. You guys need it sooner than later, definitely. I'm going to pick this rod up and cast back out there. No one's fishing now. Right now, I'm going for anything that'll bite. Looks like we got a bite on this rod. There we go. Hopefully, we didn't lose it. Nope, we got it on. There we go. We got it on. Uh, trying to catch anything that'll bite. Carp, common carp, mirror carp, bream, Prussian carp, uh, roach, common roach apparently too. We're going for that. 21 bucks for this guy. Little guy, but there we go. Ash doesn't have any rods to fish here, unfortunately. He's got uh, he's got heavy setup. He's been fishing Germany, I think. God bless it. Got a cast back out there. He's been fishing Germany, and I am not a high enough level yet. I believe it's level 42 to fish Germany. Believe it or not, I am still a level 41, so... Or 40, I think. I don't even think I've hit 41. <laughs> Alright, we got that bread back out there. Let's pick this one up and try to cast back and see if we can't land a young common carp or a young mirror carp. I'm going to try to hit that buoy one more time. Set the rod down. All right. There we go. Let's get to the chat real quick. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, we got a fish on here. Hold on, guys. <laughs> Cove, no problem, man. We'll catch you later. Thanks for stopping in. Offensive donut. Just got a seven-pound catfish in mud water. Not bad. Not bad. It's a good-sized fish. I'm not sure if that is that a trophy size there. I forgot. It's been a while since I fished mud water. Got another little common roach there. 
These guys are abundant here in this lake. It's a good little area out there for these smaller fish. This is a, this is a stream for low level people. So you guys who are lower levels, Fishing Planet veterans, you guys probably won't want to fish on this lake because it's not a big money maker or big experience lake, but you know, you might want to fish it. Just try it out, but for the most part, this is a lake for lower level individuals. Stream is giving you luck. Well, good, man. Good to hear that. Wish you much luck. We got another hit out here. Man, this uh, bread with honey is doing pretty good for these smaller fish. So this one feels a bit larger. It's Mac. It varies. It varies per lake. This particular lake is really inexpensive. It's a level 3 lake, so it only costs, I think, about $150 to get here. And uh, yeah, it only costs about $150, and I think $300 for the license for one day. So it's a relatively cheap lake, but they do get more expensive. Um, as you go up in the levels. We'll go ahead and keep that common roach. Alright, we'll go ahead and cast back. Let's cast back out towards that buoy with this one too. Go ahead and set the rod down. Electro says he can't wait to wrangle in some Euro beasts. There's some big fish. We went uh, we went to that October River. Ash showed me some good spots to fish at. We were catching Wells catfish, which get pretty big. In addition to that, we were catching uh, Beluga, European sturgeon. Got another fish on. Wow. Bread with honey, guys. Bread with honey seems to be the bait for these little fish out here. <coughs> Pardon me. But yeah, we were catching beluga, uh, European sturgeon, and they're like a endangered species in the game. You cannot keep them. No, look, oh, that's a silver bream there. Nice. A little silver bream. But yeah, you can't you can't keep them, or you can, but you risk getting a fine if you if you keep them. But they get huge. You get a lot of experience for them. But since you can't keep them, you do not get any cash for them. I do have a live stream video up there of us out there catching beluga. All right, Kof says laugh out loud. Winter Pike Tour qualifier number one tomorrow night. Okay. I don't know if I'm going to take part in that one or not. I might. We'll see how it goes. We got, man, look at that bread. Bread is unbelievable out here. Another fish on. Tommy says, hey, buddy, I know you hate it when I say this, but you ain't lagging now. I hate to be. Yeah, you, you, you might have been right, man. You very well could have been right. It could have been the fact that we were uh, connecting to your room in, in Europe rather than uh, me starting a room here. Very good observation. I think closing the Discord might have helped as well. A little Prussian carp here. So, yes, I will give you your props, my friend. Give you your props. You, you were correct. Good to hear, though, that the stream is not lagging like it has been. Keep that one and toss it back out there. Set the rod down. Tommy says Jake is going to catch some wells. That'd be great, man. If I can get over to Belgium, I'll be happy to fish for some wells catfish. I'd like to get that on video and share it with the good people at home. That would be really, really neat. Haven't really fished, actually, outside of uh, Indiana. So not only would it be cool to fish in another state, but it would be even cooler to fish in a different country. See what kind of uh, kind of fish you guys have there. It's Mac. What is your opinion of feed rods? But then, because I can't use them yet, ah, uh, you're on PS4. Yeah, I like them. I like them. You, you might... Might have to watch some videos or something on how to get them set up initially, initially, but uh, I like them. I think they're good. They add a different dimension to this game, most definitely. I've only been using them to fish in Europe. Um, 
since the new European lakes are out, I'm giving them a try. But uh, they work also on the North American lakes as well, I understand. I think KP Shimino did a few videos about that. Electro, yeah, I do. <clears throat> I do believe that's about 25,000. You get caught with them belugas, you're going to have to pay 25 Gs, which is quite a price tag, in my opinion. So it's definitely not worth it to keep them. Um, but yeah, you won't make any money off them. But if you're trying to level up, which a lot of you guys are going to have to probably do, even you fish, fishing Planet Veterans, because uh, the new lakes, there is a level 42 lake, and October River is level 46. So if you've been sitting at level 40 for a while, you're probably going to want to level up to get to these other lakes. Cove says the feeder rods are amazing. I have to agree with them. Tommy says the Belgians always do, bro. I'll have to see that in action, man. <laughs> Not that I don't believe you, but nah, I got you, brother. All right, we're going to reel this thing. Got another fish on. This, this bread with honey is working really good out here, guys. Offensive Donut says, what baits and hooks would you recommend for bigger fish in this lake? Well, to be honest with you, the biggest fish in this lake, I believe, are either young mirror carp or young common carp. We got our young Prussian carp, or uh, just regular Prussian carp. 1.10 pound. I think the biggest fish in this lake is about 3 pounds. And uh, I've caught them about, I think, up to 2 pounds here using a number 6 hook and uh, various carp baits such as sweet peas, sweet corn, and this bread with honey. Tench can get up to two pounds, maybe a little bit more, and uh, Prussian carp the same. So there's really not that, that large a fish here on this lake. Got tons of bait coins, so you'll fully buy a decent setup. Very cool, man. Bait coins do help out a lot. Electro is only level 24, man. What have you been doing? <laughs> You're slacking, brother. No, I'm kidding, dude. Yeah. Level 24. I remember when I was level 24. Tommy says, and ladies, dude is single. Can you believe that? There we go. I don't know if there's many ladies watching the stream, uh, Tommy, but if they are, yes, I am single, ready to mingle. <laughs> Cove says you don't need bait coins, just tons of cash. Yep. Oh, man. Here we go with Gamer Kevin. Boom, Basta, brother. Thank you. Hitting it up with the $5 super chat. And he's he, $25 on the go. go for, man, you rock and roll, brother. Thank you. That is awesome. That is awesome. My first, uh, my first donator to the GoFundMe, Gamer Kevin. Right on, man. You rock and roll. Offensive Donut says, thanks a lot, my man. No problem. Tommy says, boom. Yep, Gamer Kevin is, is doing the support thing. Really appreciate that. Brandon says, what lake is this again? This is the Lesney Villa Fishery in the Czech Republic. Electro says, definitely slay. <laughs> nah, I'm just, uh, just giving you a hard time, man. I know I haven't had much time to... <clears throat> or much desire anyway to play Fishing Planet up until these new lakes have been released. Not having much luck on the carp setup. The spread with honey seems to be doing pretty good, but the carp setup isn't doing that great. Let's go ahead and see here. Is it going to gonna take it nope looks like I dropped it at the last minute unfortunately Let's see Brandon Ortiz says he's been playing so much fishing planet yeah I was in uh, I was in that mindset about a year and a half ago couldn't put the game down <clears throat> pardon me uh, picked it back up, and I've, I've been playing it off and on since the uh, new update has been released. It's Max says, pretty new to game. I bought the Winter Tour Pack that comes with Christmas Giants, Pike Tour, and Crappie Valentine. Cool, man. Level 28. You, you keep it up. You'll be there in no time, dude. Be there in no time. Boom! Look at that. We got Electro 
coming in with the nine dollar and ninety nine cent super chat. Thanks, brother. It does, Electro. It does, man. It does help very much. Do appreciate that. Fantastic. You guys rock and roll. I really wasn't expecting anybody to donate or do any super chats. That is some uh, that is some dedication, and you guys know I do appreciate that. So thank you, thank you, Electro. Electro has been around, guys, since the very beginning. Very beginning, he's been around, uh, watching the videos and being supportive. Gamer Kevin has also been around for a while too. Seen him in the streams, I think, way back even when I was doing uh, Hunter Call of the Wild, if I remember correctly. But yeah, thanks again, guys. Thanks again, really do appreciate it. Dylan Wynn, good to see you on, Jake. Yeah, I haven't been doing many streams because I was having issues with lag, microphone issues, that kind of thing, but it's been a while, but I'm definitely getting back into it. Getting good feedback on whether or not the stream has lag tonight, and so far it seems like it's not as laggy as my previous ones have been. So that's cool. That's cool. If it's okay with you guys, then I'll probably do a lot more streaming with the uh, with the leg being at a minimum you try this again I'm gonna cast right on top of that buoy with these sweet peas see if we can't land ourselves another carp let's go ahead and set this rod down Uh, Brandon says, yeah, me and buddy have been playing a lot, like, all over, not quite in Alaska yet, level 35. Alaska will come to you in no time then, man, if you're keeping it up. If you keep, uh, keep it up, you'll get to Alaska. Alaska's, Alaska's got some good, good, uh, coho salmon, Chinook salmon, all kinds of salmon out there. They're fun. It's a fun little creek to fish, in my opinion. Pink salmon, chum salmon, you got a... Dolly Varden, she's got all kinds of fish out there in Alaska. Electro says, you're very welcome. Can I get a <laughs> damn bebops? That's right. Damn bebops. <laughs> I'm surprised you remember that, man. I'm glad you picked up on that, too. I don't think too many people got the uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle reference in that one. But it's good to see there's some people out there my age that understood what the hell I was talking about. Rod was going off there just a little bit. Oh, we got another we got another hit here. Boom! There we go. Boom basta. That got another fish on. See, Dylan says, glad to see you and love you all you do, man. Keep up the great work, brother. I'll probably owe you for more trophies and unis than I can count. That's awesome, dude. I'm glad to hear. That the videos have helped. Very glad that the videos have helped. That's what I do. You know, I, I knew when I picked up this game, uh, being a fisherman, I knew when I picked it up that people who aren't fishermen probably... Whoa, look at that guy. That's a big one. Trophy Prussian Carp. Good for 102 bucks. We'll go ahead and keep it. Put it in the keep net. I knew that when I started that people who weren't fishermen in real life might have a hard time figuring this game out and that's pretty much why I started doing the videos for it. so I'm glad glad they've helped you guys out BAM gamer Kevin PS1 with the $15 super chat <laughs> man right on dude <laughs> I, don't, I don't know what to say at this point but other than thanks and uh, thanks for the $9.99 uh, to Electro I'm, I'm taking then you guys rock and roll man that is so cool so incredibly cool. It's Mac. Uh, no, I do not have a video for beginner feeder setups, but that's really a good idea. That's really a good idea. I might, I might end up making one of those because uh, Hasek, who is also a subscriber of the channel, requested that um, that I create that, or that I that I let him know how to set up your feeder rods, get them all set up. Could be confusing to people who don't know, so I definitely might do that. Definitely might do that. Yes, I agree with Electro Gamer Kevin. 
Nice indeed. Here we go. We got another fish on. Look at that. That money coming through is uh, helping me catch fish. Boom, Rasta. Right on, right on. Tommy, I appreciate that, man. It's real. It's it's uh, it's true. Gamer Kevin does rock. So does Electro. Both you guys rock and roll, man. Along with everybody else in the chat, too. Glad people are here also just hanging out. We got the uh, young common carp right there. Young common carp, $86. So, yeah, let me know. Let me know, um, you guys who are interested in the funding and the GoFundMe page and giving the, the donations. If you want a breakdown of how I came to the figure, the 4500 uh, limit for the donation for the GoFundMe, let me know. I'll create a video regarding how I got to that figure, um, the equipment that I would need to get started correct, you know, get it. If I'm going to do it, I want to do it right. But I also chose equipment that isn't, you know, super expensive. I didn't get the best. I didn't have the best of everything in mind. I kind of went mid to low range in regards to equipment like rods and reels and kayaks. Just something to, uh, just something to get started. But if you want a breakdown of everything that um you know how much everything will cost and everything like that let me know i'll definitely make a video about that so you guys can see where the money is going to go to for the channel and yeah definitely Let's see gamer kevin says hope make the big time on youtube that'd be great dude <laughs> that would be great i haven't uh i haven't I try not to think about that. I try not to think about hitting the big time. I just look at this as a nice little side project. I don't want to don't want to become wrapped up in becoming a big time YouTuber, but if it eventually leads in that direction, I would not be opposed. <coughs> Pardon me. Gamer says he'll pre he'll help out any way he can. That's awesome. And yeah, you guys, I do have a Discord. I have a Discord, guys. The Discord is in the description below this video. If you guys want to check it out, along with the GoFundMe page, along with my Facebook page, along with my Twitter page. So if you guys want to uh, see what I do on social media and join the Discord, everybody is welcome. The link is in the description below. Please kick it and click it and become part of the community. See, gamers, Kevin says he's on PS4 fishing right now. Nice, dude. Nice. But unfortunately, I bet you're still on the old lakes. See, Jacob Swanson, Swabron, my bad, says hello. Hello to you, sir. Welcome to the stream. Uh, yeah, it's Mac. It should be in the description. If you can't find it, don't see it, let me know. I'll take a pause from the game and post it here in the chat. But I usually uh, usually include it in the description below the video. It should be there. And that goes for anybody. Anybody, even if you're a PS4 player, sometimes, I'll be honest with you, me and the guys in Discord, we just hang out and BS. Not always playing games. If you guys get bored, want to hang out and chat, or just see what's going on in the Discord community for the channel, you guys on PS4 are welcome to join as well. Let's see, Jacob says Scoovrin. Scoovrin. That is how I pronounce it. My bad. Scoovrin. <laughs> welcome. Gamer Kevin PS4 says, if it would not make my woman mad, I would have said, nah, dude, that's, hey, man, women are expensive. Uh, I totally relate to that, dude. No, no pressure whatsoever. That was the cool that you donated what you did. So ladies come first. You got to keep the lady happy. Keep the lady happy and you're a happy man. No hits recently. Surprised I'm not getting anything off this cart bait. I'm gonna go ahead and reel it in and switch it to sweet corn. I think sweet corn is what what worked. Jacob gives up. I'll just call you Jacob, buddy. How about that? It'll be nice and simple. That way there's no confusion. 
we'll go ahead and throw sweet corn on there and try again. Right out there by that buoy. Set the rod down. Yeah, you guys, like I said, welcome. Everybody is welcome to the Discord. I do have a subscribers channel. I uh, should be open to everybody. And you guys could hop in there. You don't if you don't have a mic, you can chat it up. We got text rooms as well where you can chat it up and you know share different topics, conversation. Not everything has to be revolving around fishing planet or fishing or anything like that. There's a lot of guys that hang out in the Discord, don't have mics, like uh, Hassock tends to. Swift the Bears in there quite a bit as well. And uh, yeah, sometimes we just get some good conversations going on on a variety of topics. So yeah, don't hesitate, guys. Feel free to, to join that Discord. And we got some new people. Sounds like we got, uh, looks like we have some new people joining. Welcome to the stream, everybody. Jake Vegas with Jake Vegas Digital here, doing some fishing at the Lesnay Villa Fishery in the Czech Republic and Fishing Planet. Check lags your laptop, but everywhere else is fine. You know what? I, I've got a pretty good gaming PC, Jacob. Got a good graphics card. I got a GTX 1070. And this lake doesn't lag my computer, but the, uh, the lake in Germany. I have fish there, and it is such a huge lake. It's got to render so many polygons that that brings me down to below 20 frames per second. And I got to adjust the graphics just to really fish there comfortably. What do we got here? Got ourselves a little silver bream. Boom bust a little silver bream, good for 18 bucks. Cast back out there. So far, not much luck on the carp baits like the corn and the sweet peas, but this bread is doing pretty damn good out here. Tommy says, yeah, we are the crew. Team JVD. Actually, uh, Tommy there, Ash, he came up with the name Team Team JVD. Got to give him credit for that. We are. Tommy says, he's still waiting for his t-shirt. We'll get merchandise, man, <laughs> eventually. Hopefully, uh, if the channel continues to grow and there's a demand for Team JVD, then uh, we'll go ahead and we'll, get, we'll start doing some... Uh, Maybe some t-shirts and hats in the future. It's Mac. Uh, Skillful is sometimes in the Discord. Not that often anymore, but he is from the UK. I know that. Another fish on. Off that bread with honey. Gamer Kevin with another donation. Right on. <laughs> Man, thanks. You, you can stop at any time. <laughs> Making me feel... Uh, that's, that's, that's great, dude. I honestly, I, man, that's such great support. I don't even know what to say at this point other than you rock and roll, brother. Keep on rocking in the free world. We got a silver bream here. Good for 24 bucks. Dylan says he'd rock it. He would rock the merchandise. Cool. Very cool. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't think I have enough people at this point in time who are going to want to run around wearing Team JVD t-shirts just yet. But, you know, if it gets to a point where there is some high demand or decent demand for it, ah, I could definitely look into, you know, maybe starting off getting some t-shirts printed up, maybe some good quality hats as well. And we can definitely go from there. Tommy's right. <clears throat> Pardon me. Gamer Kevin. Definitely got to keep the woman happy. That is a necessity. I 
UK people all over the place. Yeah, we get there are a lot of UP, uh, UK individuals. Um, there, there are a few in Discord, but there are a lot in general that are subscribed to the channel. Dylan says, throw a hook on it and start. Yeah, dude, that'd be cool. That'd be cool. I would definitely, I, you know, I, I would have to think of the design because I, I wouldn't want it to be something silly like just my face and Jake Biggest digital on there. I want something a little. Oh, oh, look at this. We actually got a hit right now off of the carp bait. I think we got sweet corn on. Let's see if it takes it under. There we go. Boom, Basta. This looks like a nice sized fish, guys. Look at that. Off sweet corn. This has got to be a carp. see Tommy says don't believe me he's been <laughs> we're working on it brother we'll get it we'll get it we will get it in time we got a mirror carp on everybody young mirror carp they tend to get rather large for this lake let's see once we reel this bad boy in what we get we got a young mirror carp 2.025 pounds not bad cut them off the sweet corn canned sweet corn good for 89 bucks look at that guy we, I don't know if we have these in America or not. I know we got young common carp or common carp in general, but I don't know if mirror carp are in North America. Some of you guys out there maybe who have uh, experience with it, let me know. I'm kind of curious if these guys are available in our area. Let's go ahead and throw right back out to that buoy. That's where we've been hitting the few carp that we caught. Did it work? Yep. Let's go ahead and set the rod down. Let's see, you are. We got you are. You are. I think is a new subscriber. Recently been commenting on the videos. Jake, is that really you? Watch your videos every day. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It is me. Welcome to the stream. You are. Appreciate your support. Seeing the comments on the videos, and now appreciate you being in the chat. Dylan says that's a cool looking fish. I agree interesting and cool looking fish Tommy says we don't have them here and I, I'll take your word for it because I don't believe I've ever seen them gamer Kevin says he would not stop till I did and Jake would love it what are you guys talking about oh the uh, the <laughs> the battle of donations yeah you'd <laughs> you'd be winning right now you would definitely be winning right now gamer Kevin I think Electro would be coming in second. Getting another hit out here. And I would love it. You 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 would uh you'd probably see me cry on stream out of appreciation. <laughs> out of appreciation. I'd be like a uh, Sally Field at uh at the Oscars when she was doing the They love me. You really, really love me. <laughs> Might be a bit too old of a reference for a lot of you guys. Some of you guys might know what I'm talking about out there. iPhone guy, what rods would I recommend for Russia? We got a common roach here. Common roach, we'll go ahead and keep it. We'll go ahead and cast back out there. set this down just for a minute let's get to the chat uh, iPhone guy I would recommend oh man I can't I can't even think of the rods right now I don't have mommy uh, Ash Tommy if you could answer iPhone guys question if you know offhand what rods would be good for Russia you've actually fished her a lot more than I have so uh, Tommy in the chat would probably know better than I do iPhone guy I remember what um, I remember having big rods but I can't remember exactly what the names of them were offhand. Stitch! Stitch626, what is up with you, brother? Fishing's going good, man. Fishing's going real good. Good to see you stop in here. How are you, sir? Dream of ITR. Let's see, It's Max says mirrors are definitely in the UK. Caught some in your lifetime. Cool, yeah, I, I know they're European. Um, but I, I really don't think we have any in North America. I don't think we have many different carp species at all, except for maybe koi and, you know, like goldfish that grew up to be rather big and your standard common 
carp, but I could be wrong on that. Not a big carp fisherman, but if you guys know differently, let me know. You are says think you're really good at editing YouTube because it is just fun to watch a video. Awesome, man. That's that's great feedback. I do take a lot of pride in editing my videos. I like to throw some music in there. I like to make sure that the commentary is good and interesting. And it's good to see that people appreciate it. So thank you. You are Dylan says, oh my frip God. <laughs> uh, that was probably a while ago, so I don't know what you're oh my effing G about. But as long as you're laughing and happy, that's a good deal. Electro says he's a union railroad worker. Let's rebattle on. Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. We got a competition going on here. <laughs> Oh, man. Kudos to you, uh, Electro. That's a hard job, I bet. Union Railroad worker. Got a couple of railroads in my area. I tried apply f applying for them years ago before I went to college and did not get selected to work for them. But uh, they are here. A lot of union workers work on them. And, uh, yeah, have respect for anybody who does that job. Stitches the Pike Man indeed. Offensive Donut says in real life Jake fishing streams would be awesome. I thought about that. I thought about not only making videos but maybe occasionally doing a real life fishing stream if I could ever get to that. I think that would be awesome, man. I think that would be awesome. Uh, unless it was a real slow day of fishing. But just being out there in the wilderness, outside, chatting with you guys while doing some fishing, that would be really cool. Great idea, man. Tommy, yes, Russia. Russia indeed. iPhone guy was asking. Uh, iPhone guy, yeah. I'm going to have to agree with Tommy on that, that indeed you'll probably need something a bit bigger than 35 pounds. Like he said there, there is beluga and Welsh catfish. They get rather large. And even the biggest setup, the biggest uh, feeder rod in the game, I think has a difficult time reeling that thing in so probably gonna have to go a little bit heavier than that 35 pounds Dylan says oh laughing at the they love me they really really love me <laughs> that was classic that was classic yeah glad you found that humorous and got it dude Dylan says he's got a bass boat and he'll let me use it that'd be cool that'd be cool uh I do need some kind of if I if I if I go out and do the real life fishing thing I do need some kind of uh, water vessel to say the least so I looked up I found a found a very nice um, kayak that is specifically for fishing it's not a high end one it is more on the lower end more medium I think it costs about 400 bucks so that is what I'm aiming to uh, aiming to eventually get is a kayak of that size. Uh, that price range uh, would be enough to get me started. Cove says, "Phone guys, the leader test you need to work." Yeah, the leader is definitely, definitely very important uh, with the feeder rods. I have broken many a leader while fishing for the uh, the different fish with the feeder rods out of here. So definitely got to agree with Cove on that. Skill, what's up, buddy? You got skillful DTS in the house. How you doing, my friend? Jake's uh, streams looking better. Cool. Yeah, that's what I've heard today. Tommy had the bright idea of not streaming while not streaming while being in uh, his room in his server. So I fired it up, started my room this time here in North America, and it seems like the lag has quit. So that is awesome. Boom. Pasta. One guy, 41 pound or more. Uh, I think it was like 41 pound or 45 pound. I can't remember. Can't remember. Um, Tommy or, or Stitch might be able to help you out with that. Got a bunch of highs between Skill and Co and Stitch. Yeah, but definitely more than 41 pounds, I would say. Holy cow, look at that. You are is in the house with a $20 super chat donation appreciation. You are welcome, my friend. Thank you. Thank you very much. So far, guys, so far we got we got some cool people. 
doing some uh, donations here. No pressure on anybody to do it, but I do want to give an extra shout out to you guys. We got UR with 20 bucks, Gamer Kevin PS4, who I can't even keep track of at this point. He's he's donated so much. Thank you, sir. And Electro has also donated ten dollars. Um, thank you. I I really don't know what else to say other than that. I can't express to you how much it means to me. So thank you guys. Very cool. Tommy says, Russian gear set up for the comments of this video. Ah, okay. Very cool. Heimdaller. Let me know if I'm pronouncing your name right. I'll just call you Heim. Oh, we got a fish on. About time. I'm just getting so caught up in the chat and the donations, I'm forgetting, uh, forgetting about the fish in here. Yeah, you are. That is that is awesome, man. Very very cool, of you dude. We'll get it going. We'll get it going. I I got faith that uh, I got faith that people will uh, see the GoFundMe page, see the situation that I'm in, and um, might feel the need to donate. Which, if they do, that'd be a great help. So it's just it's just so cool, so cool that you guys are doing this. And I will definitely. Uh, Account for every dollar spent. Let's go ahead and cast this bread with honey back out there. Boom. Go ahead and set that down. Still no other hits on the carp bait yet. Let's see, Cove says. 41 two pound is the biggest test for leaders. I'm not sure what you're saying there. Cove. Um, hard to use a feeder. Could you give me some some what's that? tips? Give you some tips. I'll be honest with you. I'll be honest with you. You know what? I uh, Where you at? You are. Uh, we were talking earlier. I don't know if you were in here, but I've got a Discord channel. You might want to join that. The link to the Discord is in the description below. Um, the feeders, the various chums. I'll, I'm not familiar with creating chums in real life. And haven't really made them on my own in the game. I have listened to Tommy. Who Tommy is from Europe. Uses chums. Feeder fishing. Does all that in real life. And he came up with an awesome chum. I can't remember the mixture offhand. But he came up with an awesome chum. We were catching carp like crazy off of it. Uh, you might maybe hit me up in the Discord. I'll talk to Tommy if he doesn't have time. I'll get the uh, the recipe for those those chums for you, and uh, I can message you that in the Discord. I simply cannot remember offhand. It's Max says, what would you do if someone donated 999 of any currency? Uh, like I said, I'd probably break down and cry, man. <laughs> I wouldn't be I wouldn't be expecting that. That would be a, truly a tremendous gesture of kindness. And uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do anything crazy like shave my head or anything like that. But just know that I would be crying tears on the inside and maybe. Maybe on the outside as well for appreciation. That's that would be that would be something else. Dylan, uh, what do I mainly fish for in real life? Mainly bass. I'm I'm a big bass guy. Do like largemouth bass fishing. Next to that would be crappie, bluegill, panfish, perch, that kind of thing. And occasionally, I do go out for some catfish. Boom! I think we got a carp on here, guys. Ooh, this might be a big one for this lake. Heim says pronunciation is correct. Cool, very cool. Yor says thanks. So you still rock. Thank you, buddy. Thank you. Yeah, I mean, no, no worries, dude. You can always hit me up on a message in Discord. We got a young common carp. We can get some chum recipes to you. Um. Get them started for you. They do help out quite a bit when catching the carp, going for the carp. 77 bucks, 
Four nine pounds. We will keep him. Put him in the keep net. Let's go ahead and cast back out there. Close to forty six. I'm planning to buy a heavy new chubber rod. So I need forty one pounder. Yeah, ah, I really wish you could remember the names of those rods for your iPhone guy. I think one is Big Cat Chaser or Cat Chaser or something of that nature. And um, I think it might be the largest feeder rod in the game. And I think the reel I got was called an Ambusher. Can't remember. It came with a DLC pack. Uh, but I believe you can buy them with in game money as well. <laughs> Go again, level 46. Juice Box. Hello, my. Hello to you, man. Hello to you, man. How is it going, Juice Box? Always, always seen your comments. I do appreciate that. Gamer Kevin. Boom, Basta. Damn. Look at that, man. Look at that with another donation, dude. You rock and roll, my friend. Along with everybody else who has donated. Along with even you guys who haven't donated, who are just hanging out and chilling. So freaking cool. Very, very cool, man. Thank you. <laughs> I am going to cry. Don't ever go to this. This is so far. It's just so much, man. <sighs> okay. All right. Done crying. Here we go. We got a fish on. Let's go ahead and take that one and <laughs> reel this in. Tommy says, button damn. Juice box is chilling. Cool. That's what we're doing. Just having a good time. Chilling out here, doing some fishing. Heavy chaser, that's what it is. 56, 2 pound. Yep. The heavy chaser, that is the big ol', the big daddy of rods in this game. Go ahead and keep that common roach. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Come on, come on, come on. Don't, don't give up. I think it gave up. Don't give up. Did I miss it? Oh, no, we didn't. We got it on the line. Right on, boom, basta. Boom Basta. Go ahead. You guys who, who have uh, donated so far, and in our next video, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys some special recognition. If you don't mind. If you, if you don't want me to recognize you guys, let me know. But, but I do like to give credit where credit's due. So I plan on giving you guys a shout-out. If you don't want that, let me know, like I said. But if not, you guys are getting shout-outs in the next video I do. So... Let's see. Um, Young Mirror Carp, 84 bucks. We'll go ahead and keep it. That's a nice fish. Nice size fish right there. 1.89 pounds. All right, let's go to Juice Box. Says always remember to keep your head up. Indeed, indeed. Let's go ahead and cast back out here. Gamer Kevin says, would it have been better for me to send that money for GoFundMe or how's how's that way? You know, um, don't get me wrong. I totally appreciate the super chats, Kevin. I'll put that. I'll definitely put that towards the fishing equipment fund as well. Um, but it, you know, for any anybody who wants to donate to the fishing equipment fund, I ask that instead of super chats, please please use the GoFundMe link. It's in the description below. Uh, the reason for that is because. I think once people start seeing the donations coming in on GoFundMe, maybe they'll start to donate as well. And in addition to that, the sooner I reach the goal on the GoFundMe page, um, I think the sooner I'll be able to, you know, use the funds to start purchasing the equipment. So definitely not bad that you did the super chat. Very cool. I do appreciate that. Like I said as well, we'll be putting that towards the fund. But um, yeah, if anybody wants to from from now on, please, please. Uh, definitely use the GoFundMe page, but uh, yeah, I don't know what else to say. That's so that's so awesome, of you guys. So freaking cool. All right, I'm gonna put this down. I don't even know where the hell I cast today. Let's go ahead and cast this bread out here again. We're doing rather good with the bread. Cast it out there. Go ahead and set the rod down. And we are good to go. Waiting for another set of fish to come and hit our bait. All 
right. Cove is doing the. If you want to see Ash catch the big fish, donate. <laughs> Can't do better than me, Ash. I'm Jake Vegas, man. Just kidding. Ash, if we were in Europe, you would definitely probably put me. If I was in Europe fishing with you, you'd probably put me to shame on the uh, the fishing there. But if you ever come out to America, brother, and do some bass fishing, I'll show you how to do it and do it right. There we go. We got another fish on. Cove is doing the winter pike tour tomorrow night. Right on, man. Did you qualify for that? Do you have to qualify for that? I don't know how that works. I never really did one of the turn. Look at this little thing. Jesus. That's pathetic. Wee bitty Prussian carp. It's all right, though. We'll keep it for 19 whole dollars. So like I was saying, this is definitely low level, guys. Low level fishing here on this lake. As you can see, all this fishing we've done, we've only got 27 pounds of fish. So higher level individuals probably aren't going to want to fish here. Let's get to the chat. See, UR says, Jake, don't need to look down the feet. Yeah, I know, man. I am, I'm aware. Like I was telling, I think Cove mentioned that earlier. And uh, my problem is that I'd probably get my rod screwed up. Since I got two here, I'll probably hit the wrong key and pick up the wrong rod. And I don't want that to happen. So uh, right now it's been working out for me using the hand icon. I'm going to stick with that for now. But uh, definitely, definitely aware of that. See, Hunter Spivey says, what's up, Jake? Good to see you, man. Right back at you, Hunter. Been a while. Been a while. It's been a while since I streamed, but it's been a while since I talked to you. Welcome to stream, man. Good to have you in here. How you doing? 39 bucks for that Prussian carp. It's a good area here for, for you guys who are low level. Definitely a good area to catch some fish at. Back down there. Juice box says, how light is gear you using? Rather light. I think the rods are about... Well, I'll be honest with you, I don't know offhand, but they're, they're right. I know the reel is a 7-pound reel, and I got 6-pound line on it. And the rods aren't much heavier than that. So it's about, about a 7-pound setup that we're using right now for the fish on this lake. Ah, registration for the tournament is today. If you register, do you automatically get into the tournament or do you got to qualify Cove? Fabio, will PS4 get this update? I believe so, but I do not know when exactly. Skill has got a 70.1 pound clear muskie. If you guys are in Fishing Planet, you're ever on Michigan, look out for Skill. He's the only one I know who pulls out those unique clear muskie like they're going out of style. He's, uh, I think he's been talking about that 70 pounder for as long as I've known him, but it, it was a good feat. Definitely a good feat. Let's see, Skill says not been streaming at the moment. Guess not able to stream. Roger that. Right on. Can relate to that. Juice box. When are we getting ice fishing? It's a good question. I think ice fishing would definitely benefit this game. I know Ultimate Fishing Simulator's got it. I'd like to see it in here. I think ice fishing would definitely be a cool addition. Cove says 20th of January. Pablo, yep, yeah, no problem. And there are definitely individuals who still play this game on PS4. Look at that. We got Gamer Kevin responding. That he says, yeah, he's playing on PS4 right now. There's there's at least one. I know, I know a lot of my subscribers are... Uh, PS4 guys, so there's quite a few in here who still play this game on PS4. We're getting a hit on our carp rod here. There we go. Bells are going jingle, jingle, jingle. We got ourselves another fish on. This one might be a rather large one for this lake as well. Childish Codino. What is up with the new lakes? They're pretty much European. European fish species, that kind of thing. They're pretty cool. We got another young Carmen carp under a buck. Buck. When I say a buck, I mean a buck is in a pound. 
But keep that bad boy. Put him in the keep net. Let's go ahead and get back out there. Yeah, but there are a few. There's a low-level European lake. Um, and I think there's a mid-range. And then they get generally higher level with two of the highest lakes, level lakes, being here in Europe. One's level 42, one's level 46. Ah, Cove says you get into the qualifying rounds. Of your Might have to do that. Tommy is taking off. Right on, brother. Kisses right back at you. Hugs, man. Hugs. Tommy is the one who really wanted to kick off the GoFundMe, so I got to thank him for that. You have a good night, brother. I'll talk to you later. Thanks for stopping in. Timothy Coates, welcome to the stream. Let's see. Juice says UFS takes too long to get to the second pond. And that is where the fishing is, if I'm not mistaken, the ice fishing. In Ultimate Fishing Simulator. I've never made it to the second pond either, to be honest with you. Pablo says, Jake, you're my favorite. When I watch your channel, I get to go fishing. <laughs> nice. Right on, man. Appreciate that, my friend. Glad I could be somebody's favorite. Look at that. Another mirror carp, guys. Another mirror carp interesting looking fish man i'd really like to see one of these in reality 46 dollars will keep them and put them on to keep net let's go ahead and go back out there go set the rod down let's see gamer kevin the hunter the call of the wild max level on them you play Hunter Call of the Wild too, Gamer Kevin? I think you do, right? Childish Codino says he's pretty pretty obsessed with the Hunter Call of the Wild these days. Yeah, it's a great game. Haven't uh, haven't got a chance to play much of the South American map, but it's pretty cool. Beautiful game, real relaxing. If you're looking for fast-paced action, and eh, not so much, but like this, if you want to just chill out, Hunter Call of the Wild is a pretty cool game. Tight lines you, Tommy. See you next time, man. It's Max says it's midnight for him, but he doesn't care. He wants that's dedication. Wanting to watch the screen a stream when it's midnight. That's some dedication. Glad you're sticking around to do that. You know I do that sometimes on YouTube videos in the wee hours of the morning. Man, I'm almost thirsty for a beer. I'm trying not to drink alcohol these days, but I do have some Blue Moon Belgian-style white wheat ale out there in the garage, in the fridge. Yeah. Thinking about grabbing one. You guys got to stop me from doing that. Shouldn't be drinking. Gamer Kevin says, yeah, that... Oh, that, yeah, what, yeah, that's right. I think I remember now. Sometimes I get mixed up on who joined for Fishing Planet and who joined for Hunter Call of the Wild, but it's starting to come back to me now. It's starting to come back to me now, yeah. Yeah, that was that was a good game. I haven't streamed in a long time. I, I might do that. Gamer Kevin says he's having a cold beer, too. Ah, I, I gotta be honest with you, dude. I've been... Been working on this whole weight loss, get in shape thing. And beer has so many empty calories. I just, I'm trying to cut down on that quite a bit. But, um, um, what the hell? One beer ain't going to hurt, right? Guys, I'm going to go run to the garage. Give me about two minutes. I will be right back here. Going to grab myself a nice Belgian white ale to enjoy with uh, Gamer Kevin here. And I'll be right back. Don't touch that virtual YouTube dial.
All right, here we go. Let's see, did I did I get a hit? Anybody? Anybody? Did I get a hit and miss it? I don't know. I'm not sure if I did or not. All right, let's get back to the chat while I'm cracking open this cold one. Oh, gamer Kevin, nah, that's yeah, you got it. I told, I always forget that PS4 is behind. I'm so ingrained in being a PC player, dude. I totally forget that PS4 is behind. Heim, cheers to you, man. Here we go. That was me. Cheers in the microphone. Got ourselves a nice blue moon, Belgian white ale. Willies, welcome to the stream, dude. Long time no see to you either. How you doing, man? Yeah, it could be if you have a drinking problem. I don't have a drinking problem though. I don't. Uh, I don't commit to alcohol abuse. Smack. Probably gonna go at 1 a.m. Understandable, dude. Yeah. No. I mean, shit. So after midnight, and you're chilling out watching uh, watching two poles in a virtual lake, doing absolutely nothing right now. So, <laughs> just the fact that you're hanging around is very cool. Pablo says a cold one and a dubby, Doobie, the Doobie Brothers. Great band from the '70s. If you guys aren't familiar with them? They got great, uh, great music. But yep, I try to uh, try to stay away from the doobage these days, simply because I'm looking for a job right now, and uh, you know. Don't want to be doing that that kind of stuff when you're on the job hunting because they give you a DRUG test. So I stay away from it. I'm doing good, Willie. Doing good. Actually, I'm doing great, to be honest with you. Um, started a GoFundMe page to do some real-life fishing, get the equipment for it, and have had some awesome support in this very stream. I just announced it in the stream. I had some awesome support in this very stream from gamer kevin ps4 uh, electronic adventure also known as electro and you are is his name his name is the letter u the letter r all of them have donated so far and uh yeah going real great man thanks for asking see pablo is going to the everglades are you asking me what the game tag is if you are I, or I don't know if you're talking to gamer kevin or not pablo my gamer tag and fishing planet is simply jake vegas all one word timothy coates what is up welcome to the stream i don't know if i said that already to you timothy <laughs> sometimes so many people come and go it's hard to keep track of everybody but yes sir i am a native hoosier Born and raised in northwest Indiana. About 45 minutes to an hour from Chicago. But yes, who's your native? Lived here all my life. Matter of fact, I've only left Indiana to go to work in Illinois and on a road trip vacation back in 1999 for spring break. Those are the only two times. Oh, in Michigan, I've been a couple of times, but that's my neighbor. Offensive Donut says he just caught a mirror carp in the same lake that we're, we're fishing at right now. Yeah, they're they're pretty. They are pretty gnarly. They are definitely pretty gnarly. We haven't got any any hits, have we? I should probably reel these in and cast them back out there. Getting caught up. Looking at the chat, drinking a beer. Let's reel this in, cast make out there. Boom. All right, we got that sitting there. <clears throat> Pardon me. 
Let's cast this one back out there too. We might be out of peak time. I'm gonna have to uh, gonna have to check that. Might be a reason why they just shut off all of a sudden. We were doing real good. We were doing real good. Yeah, exactly, Cove. Definitely checked the peak times. Willie says, if I make it to New York, he'll take me out in kayaks for some... Dude, that would be great. <laughs> that would be awesome. I, see, I was thinking about that. I was really... Here's my, here's my plan, guys. For those of you who are interested in the uh, real-life fishing that I'd like to eventually do on the channel, my plan is to get just the basic equipment I need right now to hit lakes in my area. Uh, you know, maybe maybe in Indiana, Illinois, surrounding area around me, places where I don't have to travel too far, and you know, get a tent, go to some campground lakes, that kind of thing as well. And if this if the real life fishing series does pick up, then I was thinking of even like extending it to go to, you know, subscribers, some of you guys who fish in real life too. I thought maybe it'd be cool to meet some of you in in reality and yeah get together and do some fishing so that that's something that's an idea i have been entertaining um so i would be down for that willies if it ever gets to that uh gets to that point Cove, yes, I just said that, didn't I? Check for peak times. Uh, we are not at the absolute peak, but it's not that low right now either. Looks like it's almost a continuous peak with this little dip that we're in right now. I might have to fast forward to about 3 p.m. Give it a little bit more here. See if we get any hits. If not, we'll go ahead and fast forward that time. I got something beeping. There he goes, it's picking up, the line is running. There we go. Got it on. Here we go, we'll see what we got. This is good. It's been a while since I've had a blue moon. Look at that little silver bream. Little guy. How much fish do we got now? Look at that. Only 30 pounds. All this fishing we've been doing. We've only got 30 pounds of fish here. Um, did I show you guys, some of you guys who are watching for tips and whatnot, did I show you exactly where we're fishing at? I'll show you. We spawned in here at the other side, and I walked on just a little bit to the right. Probably in this general area right here where I'm circling the mouse cursor and I'm standing there and casting out towards the middle of the lake where the mouse cursor is at right now. In case you're in case you're looking for tips or whatnot on how to how to catch the fish here, that is currently where I am at. Let's cast back out there. And we'll get back to the chat. Gamer Kevin says, make a chat. Fiber optics. Man, long time no see to you, sir. How are you? Welcome back to uh, the stream. I know it's been a while. Welcome, man. Good to see you. How are you doing? Cove says, we'd be happy to take a salmon fishing here in Scotland. That'd be really cool, dude. Really cool. I'm trying to think. If I've ever actually caught a salmon before in my life, I don't think I do. We do have some charters uh, on Lake Michigan in my area. It's not too far. I've never been on them, but there is supposedly good coho and Chinook fishing in Lake Michigan. But I've never done it. Would like to, though. Salmon fishing is something I would like to do. So, yeah, if I ever, if I ever blow up big enough... Uh, Cove to where I could, you know, not only travel the United States, but travel the world, then I uh, definitely will probably take you up on that offer someday. Heimdall says, since your friend requested Pablo. Gamer Kevin says, Jake, you ever come to Canada fishing? I'm down. Cool, man. Canada is actually not that far from me. I don't know where you're at in Canada. 
But uh, like I said, I live in Indiana. I think I got to go through Illinois, Wisconsin, maybe Minnesota to get up to Canada. But it's not too terribly far. Fiber Optics says he's doing good, just plugging away at work and getting in some cool man. God, I rem Fiber Optics. I remember. Uh, I remember. Uh, I think it was one night. I'm pretty sure it was you, Fiber Optics. I might have it mixed up with somebody else. I can't remember. Were you were you a Call of the Wild guy? Did you like Call of the Wild in addition to Fishing Planet? I honestly can't remember. Gamer Kevin is in Nova Scotia. I'll have to look that up on the map because I don't know exactly where that's at. Is it like southern Canada or more northern Canada, middle Canada, east coast, west coast? Fiber optics was a Tales from the Bayou guy. Wow. Don't get many of those these days. That's cool. Dude. I really, really like doing that series, Fiber Optics. Really like doing that series. Unfortunately, uh, didn't get as much views and as much of a following as I was hoping for, but that was a fun series. Glad you enjoyed it, man. Tales from the Bayou was really cool. Christian Thompson. Hello, Christian. What's new, man? Good to see you in the stream. Hey, Ben. More northern Canada. Ah, that's kind of a bummer. I was kind of hoping you were more on the south, south side. <laughs> so it'd be kind of like a hop, skip, and a jump away. But, you, you know, like I said, if things get to a good point, we can def we can set all this stuff up. I'd like, to fi I'd like to take time if, you know, if I had an endless supply of income. Then I would like to take time to fish with each and every one of you guys. Because all of you have been super supportive. Very cool. Tom's Play says, hey, finally. Welcome, Tom's Play. Hey, finally. Uh, are you referring to, hey, finally, it's a stream? Because you're right. Hey, finally, indeed. Those hits have... Well, I, look at that. I just said that the hits have shut off and I start getting a hit. We'll see if it actually picks it up. Nova Scotia is East Coast. Oh, well, that, that ain't bad. Atlantic Ocean side, I'm, I think I'm, I'm much closer to uh, the East Coast than the West Coast, so that's a good thing. Tom's Play. I don't... Did you have a different name back in the day? Tom? Tom's Play? I don't recognize that channel name. Were you, uh, were you titled something else that I might remember, but, because unfortunately, I'm sorry, I'm not, I'm not recalling, but, uh, welcome to the stream regardless, glad to see you in here, Skillful says, guys, Jake, catch you later, Skill, thanks for stopping in, man, we will definitely catch you on the flip side. Christian is looking forward to the updates, I don't blame you, they are pretty cool, we got one on here, here we go. Reel it in off the bread with honey. Gamer coming to you, man. I may have. Yeah, I may have had one too many beer. Dude, I just took a few sips off of this. I'm on an empty stomach, and I'm already kind of feel, feeling the effects of it. What do we got? Oh, look at that. A young common carp off bread with honey. What do you do for money? Honey! Look at that. Young common cart. 48 bucks. We'll keep them. Put them in the keep net. Go ahead and cast right back out there. Oh, Tom and Alvin. Okay, I, re I recognize you now, Tom. Welcome, man. Good to see you back in here. I know I haven't streamed in a long time. But good to see the good to see you drop in. Good to see you drop in. Welcome. So you guys who are, are coming in new to the stream, uh, don't know if you know who I am. I'm Jake Vegas with Jake Vegas Digital. We got a hit. We got a hit. Look it up. Let's see. Make, hopefully we don't lose it. Nope. Uh, Jake Vegas with Jake Vegas Digital. Be sure if you are enjoying the stream 
to hit that subscribe button to stay up to date on future content. If you're also enjoying it to the point to where you want to shoot that like button, that'd be cool as well. Another little Prussian carp. We're getting Prussian carp, but not big ones, off of this bait here. Cast back out there. Hey, Cove, uh, you seem to know a lot about the update. Are you a PS4 guy too, I take it? Keeping track of it? Just curious. So, I know most of you guys have already heard this, but I'm going to go ahead and give my spiel again. Guys, if you're coming into the stream, uh, I do have a GoFundMe page set up for real life fishing equipment. If you guys are subscribers, have been following the channel, and even if you're not subscribers, <laughs> haven't been following the channel, if you guys are interested in seeing real life fishing content, real videos on real fishing, catching real fish, do have the Go GoFundMe page set up in the link below. Feel free to visit that, no pressure to do so. But if you'd like to donate to the cause, it would be much appreciated. We got another fish on, let's see if it takes this. We've already got some donations from Gaming, Gamer Kevin, PS4, you are and Electronic Adventure. Let's see, ah, it looks like it dropped it. Totally dropped it. Dude guy is for Oh, you are on PC Cove. Oh. Did you did you see that in the uh, Steam forums or something? Because I haven't seen an exact date yet. I'm just curious where to look at for it. We're going to have to pick this up and cast it back out there. about right about there Carson 127 welcome to the stream what's up with you my friend we are just doing some fishing chilling out a couple of us are enjoying a few brewskis while we do so welcome and enjoy And strike as soon as the line oh can you I'm gonna try it Cove I'm gonna try it right now we'll see if it works oh you were right well I'll be gosh darn I've been waiting for it to beep like crazy each and every time I didn't realize you can uh, grab it and have a successful uh, hook <laughs> before it was doing that what do we got here another Prussian no, we got a silver bream. Silver bream. Silver bream. Alright guys, I think the plan of action for today is I'm going to go ahead and uh, finish this beer here with Gamer Kevin. Gamer Kevin has been kind enough to donate quite a bit of money to the channel today, which... The only way I can thank him right now is to just enjoy a beer along with him. So that's what I'm doing. As soon as I finish this beer, I think we're going to go ahead and call it quits for the day. But for right now, we're going to continue to do some fishing. And I'm going to continue to probably make an ass out of myself while I'm chatting with you guys. <laughs> so enjoy. I think we're getting another hit already. Carson says, ugh, when will this update come to PlayStation? I am so jealous. Cove says, January 20th. January 20th. Oh, boy. We got a jokester in the house. It's old Hot Ham and Fari. Welcome, buddy. Glad to see you in the stream. I was wondering if you were going to be stopping in today, my friend. Glad you could make it. Chug, chug, chug. Dude, I can't chug this beer. It's a blue moon, man. You don't chug blue moon. It's a sipping beer. <laughs> now, if I had like a 
bush light or something like that, I would definitely chug it. Or even a quarter's light, but the blue moon, gotta sip, sip it. But welcome, hot ham. Glad you stopped it, man. Ah, uh, no hits, no hits yet. I was just beeping a second ago. Better late than never, indeed. It's better to be fashionably late than unfashionably early. Christian Thompson says Pike Tournament starts tomorrow on PS4. Man, you guys are all about that Pike Tournament, huh? Might have to, uh, might have to look at that. I don't know. I'll be honest. I've been playing this game for a year and a half. I've played a couple of the uh, competitions. Never got involved in an actual tournament yet, though. Might have to. Gamer Kevin said, good old Keith's. I have not heard of that beer before. Is that a Canadian brew? Never heard of it. Vitamin K. <laughs> that sounds like a good name for it. Little vitamin K. Have you taken your vitamins today? Just my vitamin K. Yeah, I kind of figured. I heard you say that earlier, Kofi. I, I don't think I'm going to actually take part in it. I just... Uh, I don't know, the tournament doesn't seem all that appealing to me for some reason. Although I might do okay in it, but I don't know. I just don't, I'm just not, not interested in the tournament so much. Let's see, we got the chat. Gamer Kevin says, yes, it is a Canadian brew. John says, do you know when the update will be coming for PS4? We got a fish on here. Boom, Bastos, reel her in. John, um, the popular consensus seems to be January 20th. Seems to be the date that when it when it should be releasing. Uh, that's according to Cove. Cove is a big fishing planet guy. I'll take his word for it, but I can't verify it for certain. Trophy Prussian carp. There we go. It's about time. Something trophy size out of there. That is a nice size trophy Prussian carp. Good for 1.847 pounds. $102. We'll put it in the keep net. Cast back out there. Carson says, my favorite fish to catch a spotted bass in this game. What about you guys? Uh, there's there's all kinds of... I can't really name one, to be honest with you. For me, I don't know what other people really like to catch, but... I like to catch all of them for different reasons. Mm -hmm. Got another fish on there. Starting to pick up. We might be getting out of that little slump in the peak time. Uh, Tom's players are much lure fishing. Uh, on the European lakes, I'll be honest with you, not much. Uh, there's young northern pike on there. There, there's some Xander, also a few other fish. I haven't really fished them too much, but it's a lot more of this bottom fishing. Look at that young mirror carp, 1.550 pounds, 68 bucks. That was caught off bread with honey. I think you guys who are lower level can get that bread with honey. Cove says clear musky. I haven't caught many clear musky. I've caught northern pike and a few regular musky, but not many clear musky. Hot Ham says he's got dynamite to hand out. That'd be good for a tournament. Good old crocodile Dundee style. Mm -hmm. 
John says, what's my favorite Lake Pre update? Oh, man. That's a good question. Uh, I'm going to have to go with either Florida or Michigan. Florida's good because I enjoy the bass fishing there and the tarpon fishing be cool sometimes. But Michigan, yes, Michigan has the northern pike that will earn you quite a bit of money if you fish for them and have the right size keep nets. So it would come down between Florida and Michigan. Christian likes the Chinook. Yeah, the Chinook are good, too. They're fun, especially out there in Alaska. Fun to catch those guys. Put up a good fight. They get rather large, too. We got another fish on here. Let's do it, Cove says, and pick up the rod and set the hook. Hopefully we get it. Yep, yeah, we do. Cove was right. Holy cow. Heim has got... 4.3 million in fishing planet dollars. That is insane, dude. <laughs> That's a lot of fishing planet, my friend. I don't know why I'm moving. Oh, there we go. Got another Prussian carp here. We'll keep it. Walk back down here. Back it up. Nope. Why? I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know what's going on here. My my dude is moving. Can we set these off? That'd be cool. Let's try it. Oh, I can only do it during an event. That's a bummer. Why is my dude moving? Stop moving. How do I put this damn thing away? There we go. No, put it away. Put it away. No. Shit. Anybody know how to get rid of this? Is it F? Fireworks? Ha ha! Have yet to have that happen to me. Where is my rod? There we go. Come on, boy. Pull out your pull. Oh, that sounded wrong on so many different levels. Alright. Go ahead and cast back out there. Set the rod down and see what we can catch. Let's see, Liam Street says yes. Liam, welcome to the stream. Cove is uh, yep biggest money maker in this game. Got to agree with Cove on that. Dark Void. Do you know if glowing lures work well in the rain on Emerald Lake uh, at nighttime? I know they work at nighttime. Haven't fished the glowing ones during the daytime. I don't think, but. If you got a glowing shed or a glow worm, I've had luck at nighttime catching the uh, walleye out there off of them. Dude, guy, got a trophy for applying for that pike turn. That's cool. Did you get any gold or any other rewards for it? Sounds interesting. Hot ham and farty smiles. Cove says can only set them off at White Moose Lake. That makes sense since they got the pier that goes all the way around. I think the one time that I did set them off was at White Moose Lake. Now that I think about it. Dark Void says hello from Ireland. I say hello from America. <laughs> Welcome to the stream, Dark Void. Dude, guys got one gold. That's not that much. <laughs> well, at least you don't need gold necessarily to play the game, but it does help on uh, rare occasions if you're struggling with cash. We were getting a hit, but it left us. Come on, fishy, fishy, fishies. Yeah, I'll tell you what, Gamer Kevin, if you're still there, this this beer is uh, is working on me. It's been a while since I've had one, especially on an empty stomach. Oh boy. Yes, I gotta agree with Christian Thompson as well. The narrow poop 
poop. <laughs> what the fuck? Narrow purple spoon works real well for the walleye at Emerald Lake at nighttime. The uh, fourth ounce one is what I normally use when I'm out there. Have real good luck with it. Just a lazy day in Czechoslovakia. Is that even is is that even what the country's called anymore? Is it still called Czechoslovakia or is it just the Czech Republic these days? I honestly don't know. Uh oh, we're getting a hit. It just beeped. There it goes. Will it take it? It's taking it. Let's see if we can set the hook on this bad boy. Boom, boss. So we got it on the line. Reel her in. Come up here, and we got ourselves a young common carp. There we go, guys. My beer is just about done. I've been streaming a little bit longer than usual. I think we're going to go ahead and end it here. I hear ear. Man, see, I'm already slurring my words. Don't even know what the hell I'm saying. <laughs> One beer, guys. Got to get back in the game here. So, yeah gonna end it here want to appreciate everybody for stopping out showing your support guys if you weren't in here earlier uh do have a gofundme page set up to get some real fishing equipment for some real fishing out there i'd like to do videos on that if you guys are interested no pressure please feel free to donate to it the gofundme link is in the description below want to give a special thanks to Gamer Kevin PS4 donated quite a bit of money today thank you sir much appreciated you are donated $20 today. I remember that. Thank you. You are. Do appreciate that. And last but certainly not least, someone who's been with us from the very beginning, Electro, Electronic Adventure, has donated $10 as well. Thank you, everybody, for your support and your donations. It will be put towards the uh, fishing equipment that I need. Thanks again, everybody. Appreciate the support. You guys, you guys know the drill. If you enjoyed this video, shoot that like button. If you'd like to stay up to date on future content and haven't done so already, please subscribe. Jake Vegas with Jake Vegas Digital. Thanks for watching. Keep on fishing in the free world, and we will see you next time. Peace out and thanks, everyone.